So, just a quickie. Um, the two witnesses. Now, if we really were in the last throes of the end times, and, you know, as I've said, um, the two witnesses would now be very prominent, wouldn't they? If, you know, all that's true. And I was thinking about the two big whistleblowers. There are two main ones, aren't there? Julian Assange and um, I've forgotten his name now. What's his <laughs> What's his name? Oh, I just watched a video. He's in he's in Russia at the moment. Oh, come on. Come on. his bloody name. Why do these things happen? Why did it suddenly come out of my um, mind? Strange, isn't it? Whistleblower. I mean, you'd think before I'd make the film, I'd know what I was. Um, whistleblower in Moscow. <laughs> Obviously, loads of you are probably s saying the name. Well, loads of you. Hardly anyone watches this. Snowden! Edward Snowden, there we go. So, these two main whistleblowers, they're both kind of being treated in a similar way. They've both been around for quite a few years. I think they fit some of the descriptions like, um, you know, people hate them. Well, the people on the inside do, obviously. And uh, so I thought that was um, interesting and worth mentioning. Okay, bye.